fifth day of December in the year of our Lord, 1648, by virtue of the power vested in us by our noble sovereign, this tribunal of Turbay sentences you, the crimson executioner, to death. You will die by one of the very instruments you devised to torture and kill your innocent victims. You dare to take into your own hands the laws of both God and man. You set yourself up as both judge and executioner. You caused inhuman suffering and took life not from any sense of justice, but from hatred and self-gratification. You showed no mercy to your victims, and no mercy will be shown to you. You'll never kill me. Move along. I'll return and be avenged. Turn around. All of you, I am the Crimson Executioner. <laughs> this day shall be written in blood. No man can judge me. I am the Supreme Law. I shall have my revenge. The seal of this tribunal will entomb forever both your body and your evil soul. Let no man dare to break the seal. You are accursed, eternally damned, as are these dungeons, as is this castle that has witnessed such indescribable horrors. Your castle will stand throughout the centuries as a reminder of the barbarism and cruelty committed within its walls. May the dust of time not erase from the memory of man the infamy of the Crimson Executioner.
Ah. Not bad. This seems exactly what we've been looking yeah. for. From here, it looks great. Just what we need. I think we should be able to wrap up our work here in a day. And this'll look good. Come on, Nancy. Gosh, I'm stiff from that long ride. It's made to order. Yeah. We don't want to lose you. Hmm, sure looks gloomy. How would you girls like to have a castle this old to live in? You'd have to be a creep to live in a place like this. I'd love to have a house like this all for myself. Imagine the peace and beauty of living all alone here. <laughs> You're a funny one, all right. <laughs> all right, girls. Wonder what it looks like inside. What's wrong? Are you tired? I don't know what it is, Perry. I just feel very uneasy. No. Susie. Let me alone, Raoul. Don't be like that, baby. Everybody will see it. Have it your way. Are you all dead? Lay you any odds you want, our dear publisher will wind up saying, this place isn't suitable after all. Let's go home. Hello, is everybody out? If they're all out, how can anyone be in the house? Uh, the brain has spelled it out. I'm not just a dumb blonde, you know. Who says you're a blonde? Must be in Hello, why doesn't anybody answer? Maybe nobody lives here. What a nuisance. Someone should have told me the castle's empty. We might as well try to get in anyway. Maybe one of the boys could scale that wall. That's a job for Tarzan. Who's going to volunteer to climb the wall? <laughs> OK, OK. Here comes Uncle Perry, the greatest acrobat in the world. Betty gets us inside. Yeah, you're right. Three years for unlawful breaking and entering. Take care, Perry. 